What's going on folks, it's Wayman the Gaming here coming at you with a how-to video on installing Final Fantasy XIV and trying to get it up and running on uh, on your Steam account. Currently I'm actually running uh, Ubuntu 20.4 LAT. This is the beta version so it's still in development. Um, basically you have to go to this website I've been using is Steam Proton. Type in Final Fantasy 14. This is more like a visual guy. It basically show you how to do it. But if you like me to actually using a uh, a second hard drive, it's the same thing. Instead of just going to home, steam, dot, blah, 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 whatever. I found out if I just copy this, copy uh, Final Fantasy boot dot config and go to file and go to your the hard drive with your actual steam library is in you go to shirts and put that same um, name right there it brings you right to the file you double click the file and on the uh, report it says it changed browser from two originally it was at two Delete it, hit one, save it. And this postal fell on purpose. So this is what I'm gonna do on the second part. As soon as you have to play it, hit start game, whatever your uh, character server is on. Of course you had to hit yes. I'm actually using a controller, don't judge me. I think I got it calibrated. So it hit start. It's going to be the same. It's going to chaos. Uh, I'm not going to It's going to connect. You can see this black screen like it's not working at all. That actually going to generate another file you need to config, which is Final Fantasy 14 dot config, which I'm going to exit this out and bring that up. So I'm going to type this in real fast. Whoops, copy and paste. I with copy and paste this real fast. Oops. A location workflow. Pace. Brings you right to it. And you go look for cutscenes. Cutscenes movie opening. You go change it to one. Yeah, I can tell you what number it is as soon as I find it. Oh, yeah, I just had it. Uh. Is that number 178? So you just scroll all the way down to 178, highlight the zero, put one, hit save, say exit out. All right, let's play it again. I'm going to put the launcher on the other side of my screen so I can type in my password and everything. See, is this a way I can show that screen? Yeah. I, I'm showing this screen. Also, if you get this error, it's okay. The only thing you have to do is hit okay. It's going to exit out. Log right back in. You have to keep doing it. It's like a dead car you're trying to crank. Oh, 
Okay. Hit play. And let's see how it goes. Able to obtain character data. Well, it actually works. Not sure why it doesn't. Also, side note, I actually downloaded, uh, uploaded my <laughs> my character stuff. So when I actually have to come over here, there we go. All right, see. Pretty much, I was just looking all over it on YouTube. There's pretty much not a lot of people who have this uh, video, a uh, visual of it. It's just all text. I'm just waiting until I can get to the server. And currently, low level machinist. He's like 65 right now. This is it right here. So this is Wayne McGaming. I appreciate. Hope this is helping somebody. This is Wayne McGaming, and I am out. <laughs>